So as you know, we launched in June uh, this year our latest, greatest Novo GPU, GTX uh, 5AVN. And uh, uh, before I go in the details, just to uh, uh, summarize a couple of things we have about the GeForce on the notebook. So basically, we are the number one uh, notebook uh, graphics brand again. Because you saw the latest numbers, we are the leaders in the discrete graphic in the notebooks. We have the fastest notebook GPU ever created, which is GTX 580. And this is very important to say, it's really the fastest notebook GPU on the market. And uh, what is important as well to mention that Optimus is now quite successful because it's shipping in almost every single OEM available on the market. And we have a notebooks like, for example, Alienware M17EX, which is now featured with Optimus. So you will get uh, basically the battery life of uh, a small notebook and performance of a big notebook. Uh, you know, can you imagine 17 inch notebook, a gaming one, running uh, in five hours battery life, which is quite cool. And uh, uh, when we go uh, now more to the Optimus details, I don't need to cover it much because then I will show the later demo, the later demo we have here. But this is still by far. Uh, the best switchable graphics technology uh, available on the market. This is the seamlessly automatic switching uh, between the GPUs and it's becoming now uh, even better with the systems that are available on the market. So, uh, as I said, the GTX 580M is the fastest number G uh, GPU available. I mean, it was proved in many tests and uh, I can really recommend you to, to try it because the games you can run on uh, the systems are really amazing. I will show you later now, we have a demo to show you the Crysis 2 running it uh, on the GTX 580M in the highest settings on the notebook, a 17 screen, 17 screen in the full HD and it looks really, really awesome. So, besides of this, with 580M you can finally enjoy all these uh, new techs uh, on the notebook as we have on the desktop. So we have a really very cool Derek X11 FX, you can have a physics, you have a 3D, you basically have like uh, the older features from the big gaming system. So one of the this is probably the first time you can play uh, with the notebooks when you travel like you are in your home with the desktop system and you have a games in the same quality with the same methods. So uh, there are the, the many notebooks now, or many like few notebooks available with 580 m because this is just um, you know for the big system. It's not for the small notebooks. So my, my one of the favorite systems is just. Uh, for example, Alienware M18EX or the M17EX, which is now uh, available with the Optimus and again allows you to have like five hours battery life. Uh, M18EX, uh, it's as well available with, uh, could be in a single card or the SLI. With SLI, of course, the Optimus is not used, but with SLI, you will get like double performance of the 580M, which is really killing it. In that case, you, you can have easily the system faster than most of the desktop cards. And uh, just to show you how the game uh, looks like, as you see here, I have an M17X uh, from Alienware, uh, which is one of the coolest gaming notebooks available on the market with uh, GeForce GTX 580M. And I have a here Crisis 2. This Crisis version here is the latest one with DirectX 11 patch. And just to show you that we have everything uh, here on the Max. So, you see that we have a high res textures, we have all the details on the Ultra, and as well, if you check the graphics, we have a enabled DirectX 11, so basically the highest maximum specs available. So, um, let me just resume the game to show you how the game is running on, on the notebook. We are now running in full HD resolution, which is basically uh, like the native resolution of the screen on the M17X. And, uh, uh, first time when I saw it, I was really amazed because uh, to have a notebook on such performance, it's really cool. So we need to wait a little bit because it's loading all the textures and the data. So, as you see now, we're running everything on the max, including the motion blower hole. myself in this ago. I will show you later how the tessellation looks like. Definitely looks cool on the normal, it's amazing how fast we can do it. So, just check here, you see the 
these the footprints from the tars. It's everything is tessellated here. I like this level to show because we have a many tessellation stuff here. Like for example, we can check these rocks. I can't switch now, like disable the tessellation, but definitely you can see it on the rocks and uh, uh, here on the ground. It's uh, it's the highest possible setting you can get out of this game. And you see M18, M17 is it's running. It's like completely smooth. It's a really amazing gaming mode.